So there it is, the actuator motor for the center differential or the transfer case um, on the 1997 Land Cruiser. So I already uh, tested it and found found out that uh, the motor is good. Um, I believe there is something there is something wrong with the uh, with the relay or something else. Uh, obviously, it's not getting it's not getting any uh, power to it. So the way I tested it is that I uh, connected it to a 12 volt, volt battery, and uh, I just just used the two prongs. Uh, on the service manual shows those two prongs right there Let me focus right here actually those two right there on the the top left corner and the center on the top those are the two that are, are gonna get power to to the motor so right now it's in the lock position you can see right there uh, somebody put those marks those marks were already there I don't know if they came from factory which I believe they did or if the previous owner of this Land Cruiser uh, changed the motor uh, I, I think this is an original motor so anyways I'm gonna assume that those two marks right there one on this gear and the mark on the body of the uh, actuator is probably the lock position so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna connect it to the center one top right there and okay let me uh let me put in pause so yes um, so I connected one terminal of the battery to the center and I'm gonna I'm gonna touch it right there and the motor is supposed to move you can tell right there right so right there it's on the unlock position uh, that gear right there turns um, that one right there it turns almost three quarters of a turn uh, so I believe that's that's all it needs so I'm gonna assume that this motor is good I'm gonna put it back to the lock position that's what the manual says the service manual that whenever you install it back install it in the lock position so that's what I'm gonna do uh, we're gonna invert this give me a second please so I'm gonna invert so the uh, the gear goes back to the lock position so I'll just put it on the I just put the positive on the other prong and I'm going to connect the negative on the top right on the picture. See right here. Uh, it's kind of... I don't have no help. So I'm going to put it right there and the motor is supposed to go back to the lock position. And it's not. For some reason. Okay. Okay, I was on the wrong prong. It was the, it was uh, this one right there. So let's look at the motor. You guys look at the motor. I look at the. Okay, it's not moving. Please. So what happened is that <laughs> I ran out of power on the battery, on the 12 volt battery. So I'm recharging it now. Uh, anyways, so we're inver inverted those prongs. So the the gear is supposed to go back counter counterclockwise to get to the lock position. Let's see right there. 
little more. I believe I'm gonna return it, but you got you got the point. Uh, we gotta put it right there, and I'm gonna I'm gonna put this motor back to the uh, to the transfer case, and I'm gonna try to find out what what's wrong with it uh, with this whole thing. I believe it's the relay. I'm not sure, but that's that's the last option I have, I guess. I checked the fuses and fuses are okay. So, anyways, uh, I'll keep you posted.